Hello there. <clears throat> and welcome to another talk. Uh, this talk is called It's Unconscious Trauma Which Makes One Feel the Need to Virtue Signal. Uh, I was out the other day in a shop, in a cafe, and you know, this virtue signaling thing, I only found out about it after the COVID thing. And, uh, but the other day I saw it for myself. I was sitting in this cafe, and it's a cafe come shop, and the people that were coming in the shop, they were like, and they were all doing it. They would use hand sanitizer, and what they were doing is going in the shop, using the hand sanitizer, but looking around them to see if anyone could see. You know, and basically what that what they're trying to say is, look at me, I use hand sanitizer, I'm a good person. And honestly, virtue signaling is a real thing. But I'm not going to come here and just demonise them. You know, I want to talk about the cause of it. You know, well, why would someone just obey to authority like that? Why would someone just obey to anyone like that? And look for attention like that? Well, it's it's because of fear. You know, it's because these people have been, are traumatised individuals. If you get a person that's seeking attention... If you actually, instead of demonising them... If you actually put yourself in their shoes... They're doing it because they feel that they're not enough. So that's why I say in all my talks that the core issues on the planet is our emotions. Is the, the core issues I believe I believe I believe <laughs> I believe is unconscious trauma. Uh, because that's the only that's why you know you get people that are attention seeking that do this kind of stuff, you know? You take Marcus Rashford, now I'm, I'm a Manchester United fan, and uh, that lad, you know, didn't eat when he was a kid sometimes, so he's traumatised. Now, because his mum didn't have enough money. Now, when you, when you see some of the interviews after games, he's got his mask on when, when his teammates, when they did their interviews, didn't have masks on. So that's an example. It's trauma that makes one feel the need to do this kind of stuff. But with him, you can understand that because he starred as a kid. That's going to traumatise you. That's the thing. So, so I'm using that as an example. Right? You can understand his reason for doing that. But what are these other people's excuse? You know, especially people that haven't had problems in their, in their physical life on Earth... Well, it's, it's not this physical life, it's, it's maybe a past life. Because your unconscious traumas go beyond this lifetime. It might not even be something that happened in this life. It could be, like I said a moment ago, it could be a past life. And that, that manifests itself as insecurities, this is why you get narcissism. It manifests itself in unconscious, unconscious uh, insecurities and fears. And that's the reason why anyone will try to get attention. Why, why someone feels a need to, like the other day, one after the other, using hand sanitizer, but looking around them in the shop to see if anyone could see them. That's what they were looking for. It's pathetic, but it's a pathetic act, <clears throat> excuse me, that only a traumatized child would do. Uh that's the thing about it. It's the it's the act of one who's traumatized. And so what I want to talk about here is the solution to it. You know, what is what is the solution to to fixing this need to virtue signal, this need to seek attention, this need to do this kind of stuff. You know, people they're not they're not wearing a mask to keep you safe. They're doing it because the government's telling them to. They're like nodding their little head. Now the only reason you'd nod your head to 
authority or anyone you think can protect you is for that reason, for someone can protect you. And so these people, I believe, I believe that they are traumatized unconsciously. And that's, that is the reason why anyone clings to anything or anyone. Why anyone seeks attention like that. Why anyone would nod their little head like that. And just do whatever they're told. You'd have to be a very frightened individual to do that. But there's the solution to these traumas, like I'm saying. Also, before I talk about the solution, do you know that asthma, it's actually... Uh, as a doctor called Dr. Gabor May, and you can look this up on the internet, asthma is actually produced from trauma either at birth or before birth. I just wanted to get that out there. Yeah, but the solution to to the this virtue signaling is to ask yourself why you feel the need to virtue signal. Meditate on the feeling that, that, that makes you want to, to do that. And what you'll notice is, you'll notice there's a nervousness in your body. At this, the moment you feel you want to virtue signal, meditate on the feeling, and you'll notice your body will start to feel nervous. That's the trauma. You've hacked right into that trauma. And that is the solution. Because when you meditate on your traumas, you you at that moment are the therapist and your, your traumas are opening up to you. And that's how you heal this issue. Because if you think about it, it's not rational to do that, is it? To to to, to virtue signal constantly. It's it's pathetic, really. And there's so much of this going on. So much of it. Uh, and I'm not going to talk about I can't I'm not allowed on YouTube I've had two strikes against me so I'm not allowed to talk about anything political this is this is the level that we're dealing with you know there's no surprising that there's virtue signals because the the people in authority are are the, they're insane themselves you know I'm not even allowed to talk about anything political not allowed to say nothing like that so obviously they've got something to hide. Uh, but the but but even people like that that want to control and censor. You know, if you look at it from from a compassionate standpoint, you'll actually understand that these people themselves are traumatized. Because to want to control another, that's a fear there. That's a fear to want to control people. There's in there in that is a is a unconscious fear, and that comes from trauma. You see, so that's why I don't talk about political issues any anyway because the core issue is the trauma because the trauma makes the what the um someone feel the need to virtue signal and get attention that way, and nod their little head in fear to the to the system. Yes, it's pathetic. But I don't just want to say that, I want, to, I want to give the solution. And the solution, like I say to this issue, is to meditate. Just at that moment, you're away to virtue signal. Seek attention. Meditate on the feeling and you'll notice your body feels nervous. That's the trauma. And then you heal it by feeling it. And uh, I'm just going to leave it there. For latest updates, talks, news, research and, and much more, please do visit my website at www.lovelikefamily.com. Thank you.